Well, let's get the final round underway. EA Sports and the PGA Tour proudly present the season-long race for the FedEx Cup. Today, it's live final round coverage of the Charity Invitational. Frank, through the years, there have been some great winners at the Open Championship played at Royal Troon. Well, just in recent uh, history, remember Mark Kalkovec here in the playoff with Wayne Grady and Greg Norman. Um, there was also Todd Hamilton when he beat Ernie Els in the four-hole playoff. And back in 1996, Justin Leonard was to win his Open Championship. Tom Watson also won an Open Championship here. Tom Weisskopf, his only major, that was 1973. The great Arnold Palmer, Bobby Locke, they all won at Royal Troon. Get it up. Frank couldn't ask for anything more. Uh, just the lie there, too. It is sitting up like it's teed up. Chance to set himself up for a good scoring opportunity with his second shot here. Oh, he could. Should be safely on deck. Terrific golf shot. And now that for an easy birdie. Birdie here yesterday. This putt again for birdie. A great stop. Frank, as we step to the tee here at the par four second hole, just 391 yards, but a classic case on Lynx Golf where the bunkering here is just so much different than a classic American layout. And it's also where a change of strategy will certainly help. Remember, the ball's going to run much further here in Scotland than what it will in America. So you can use a shorter club and let that ball to run out to the normal distance you would hit it, perhaps with two or three clubs more. About 99 yards to the hole. Frank, when you look at great rivalries in sports, you realize that athletes need each other. Joe Frazier needed Muhammad Ali cool. to achieve great, to achieve legendary status. And in golf, Tom Watson nice. needed Jack Nicklaus to push him to another level. And also to define an era. Uh, without one, we couldn't think of the 80s or the 90s or the 2000s or the 2010s. You need those players to define that era. So you need competition. Competition is not without rivalry. In the hole and the bird. Frank, looking at the third, what are the sort of key decisions that you have to make? There's two bunkers down the left. They're not really the issue. They're the burn. That's about 285 yards. This is not a hole, really. You just take the driver out. And Come on, Wayne, bring it. Uh, Come on, Wayne, bring stays it. Just up short of that. It's just going to leave you a short iron in. Frank, that swing looks lively and strong. Oh, the, that had to fly 300. Um, it's close to 310. Chance to get it close here. Frank, he appears to be in control of his game in the early going. I like what I'm seeing out there, doing all the basic I'm glad things you mentioned at a that. very, very high it. level. Getting the ball in play, that helps set up the next sit, shot. Next sit. shot gets on the green, that's how it sets up the birdie putt. It's nice. one thing leading to another. Yeah, Superb I'm checking it now, yeah, mother. It's, uh, it's as good as it's going to get. There's going to be no worries about making that one. I'm glad birdie you mentioned that, because I've got all about it. This whole yesterday. Just check on my medicine. Done it. Bucket down hole. He's made it. It's a dog leg right, par five, the fourth hole. Can you cut the corner here, Frank? Well, you don't have to. Uh, there is a bunker down the right side that's going to take at least 280 yards to get past that. You can also Ooh, cut it around there and nice. sort of follow the shape of the hole. Excellent start off the tee. That's a great way to begin this hole. And from the fairway for his second shot here. Get 
Come on, be good. Be good. Tasty looking right there, Frank. Just a perfect spot in the fairway. That is prime real estate. How do you get a line like that? Seriously, you could hit any club from there. Come on, sit, sit. Poor yes. strike, good result. Right, and that is close. Not a gimme, but well within his range. Book it. Frank, this is a player in full flight right now. It looks too easy right now. Now to the par three fifth. Frank, what are you trying to do here? Really, anything on this green is going to give you a birdie putt. So allow for the bounce and roll. Just avoid those three bunkers on the left and that short one right. Come on, be good. Get the yards. Get the yards. Beauty. This hole really sets up well for the player. Birdie yesterday, and a chance for another one today. This hole's been good to him. Birdie yesterday, and trying for another one today. No one in the book. Ben Crenshaw right there, just so smooth. No played before. Well, Frank, typically when you step up to a par five, you're thinking birdie, maybe even eagle. But this is 601 yards, behemoth. It's long, and you can get punished for a mistake here, can't you? Get it used to be the longest par five on the Open Championship rotor. But remember, there's humps and hollows that can always be used in your advantage. To your advantage. If you aim it down the right side, the ball normally kicks back towards the middle of the fairway. So that's the side to be aiming on. Good line in the fairway. Good chance to make something happen here. Come on. Be good. Be he good. And it is going towards the rough. Frank, better than we thought it was going to be. Yeah, that looked like it was headed for that thick stuff the whole way. But uh, a little fortunate. But then I guess you're allowed that in this game. But he's set up for his third shot here. Looking to get it on the green with this. Nice. What do you try up next? Been pretty good all day from this distance. Just trying to take care of business. Continues to amaze yet another birdie, and what a day it's been. Ball's teed up, ready to fly here at the seventh. Yeah, it's a slight elevated tee, so you see all the problems in front of you. A couple of bunkers down the left, two down the right, but it's Lynx golf, so you know where you've got to go. That's Get in up. between them. Pretty good drive here. Another straight one. I mean, he just blasted it down the fairway. Well over 325 yards. Has only 90 yards here. Come on, get up. This one looks like it's headed right for the middle of the dance floor, Frank. Nice. Rather nice shot, I would say. Good chance now for a birdie. That was an outstanding play. Well, it's almost a guarantee there after that shot. So a tester from four feet. Fifty on the bar. Let's go. Drops for a birdie. And what happened here in 1973? The old squire, Gene Sarazen himself, made an ice. He was 71 years old playing his final open. Oh, good look at Birdie. He really likes this hole. Made Birdie yesterday. Can he do it again today? Oh, 
Get in! Yes! What a pup! Oh, what a bonus! Frank, how does the front nine finish up with this par four? Well, the par four ninth is called the Monk. It's not overly long, 423 yards, dog leg to the right, just one bunker down the left to be avoided. Get him. Frank, this is a way to make golf easy when you can hit it that deep. Yeah. You say, I know that first number's a three. I'm guessing the second one's a two. Let's call it 320. Frank, this is a position where a player is absolutely licking his chops here. Good chance to make a birdie. Yeah, this is when this game just looks like fun. Bunkers don't seem to be in play. The only thing you're really looking at Come right on. now is just go. Nice. He's making the game look very simple right now. See it, hit it, and he's got it right on track. Shouldn't be a problem here, but not a formality either. Nice. Just an amazing display. The records continue to fall. This has got to be Just my best tournament score ever. On the front side, he's hoping to keep it going here on the back nine, Frank. The game is so much easier when you're swinging well, putts are going in. Really, you've just got to keep out of your own way. That's an absolute tracer right mm. there. In the fairway, and well over 320 yards. Well, Frank, as we know, golf is not played generally on a flat surface, and here we go, uphill. Yeah, and the uphill lie is going to guarantee you more loft than normal. So you're gonna have to counteract that with uh, maybe an extra club. Come on, be good. This be one good. has a chance to be close. Be good. Oh! Just a <laughs> shot. You're not gonna see much better than that. God, I'm on fire done. today. Book it. And he has it for birdie. Hole number 11 is called Railway. Frank, it looks as though it should be called Gorse because that's about all I see on this first shot. Without doubt, the well, toughest tee shot you're going to face at Royal Troon. This is hit the fairway or start racking up a big score. And now it's right in his wheelhouse. Good position where he can attack the pin. Yeah, he has all those options now. That ball's sitting up. You can bring it in high. You can bring it in low. The choice is yours. Get the yards. Get the yards. Well, there's a big green. Get the yards. Yeah, use every inch of it. You did. An exceptional shot on the green and in position for a birdie. Yeah, it's a formality now. Standing over this putt, concentrating on the read. Okay. He's made it. Hmm. <laughs> Frank, how do you size oh, up the I keep you on on one of my videos, well, you know, so you never know. Yards, you'd think it'd be a rather easy par four, but that's not really the issue. The issue is Gorsh oh, right and left. sounding nice. The officials are calling that one around 310 yards. Second shot. Good look at the green. Get the yards. Get the yards. Sit. Beauty. Booty try up next. This would be nice. A birdie on the card. See if he can make it. Continues to roll it very well all day long. 55 under. Jesus. Frank beginning to head towards home. This is the 13th of par four. 
another dog leg right. Uh, problem isn't really the tee shot here, even though there's undulations and mounds all over the fairway. Second shot's played uphill to an elevated green. Excellent start off the tee. That's a great way to begin this hole. This is a 150-yard shot, his second. Don't get your abs. Sit down. Sit. Sit. Nice. Nice. Right there. Number one. In the hole. And the bird. On the tee here at 14. It's another par three, Frank. You don't right. get caught looking at the front of the green. That's where it's at, at its most narrow. Ideally, something that pitches just into the top of that mound. Come on, be good. Be good now. I think he's headed for it. Sometimes he get breaks, and he got one right there. Yeah, I guess uh, the bunker was uh, a little smaller than I thought it was. Look green for that. Get in! What Again, a shot! Shots. Every now and again, one's going to go like crazy, crazy. Book it! <laughs> Everything's going into the there. 15th, this Everything. is over 480 yards. The yeah, key here really is the three bunkers. Two on the left, one on the right. 260 yards gets you past that. Wow. If you find the fairway here, then Tattoo you don't have to worry about bitch. the three bunkers that are short of this green. That's a good spot right there. Send a cup. Excellent, perfect position. Ball's just sitting up to you could hit anything from there. And from the fairway for his second shot here. Come on, be good. Sit down. This is a Sit good down. looking shot. Sit. Whoa. Chance for Birdie after that beautiful shot. Rock him and stack him. Fucking hell. Absolutely murdering this course. Absolute murdering it. Frank, here's the only par five on the back nine at Royal Troon. You'd think at 542 yards it would be reachable, but the burn that cuts across really limits the tee shot to ah, about 280 yards. Didn't catch that it's well. very much about placing that second Get over shot that in a good distance for your throw. In the 1997 Ooh. Open Championship here at Royal Shoot. Tour, you played with Tiger Woods in the third round. What did he do at this 16th hole? He hit a driver for a second shot into a head breeze from about 270 yards, managed to get it on the green, mm. then knocked it in from about 45 feet for eagle yeah. you knew he was something special back then didn't you uh yeah he was the only one that even tried that shot come on be good be good sit down sit 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 oh slightly over it that one that was just a gutsy shot right there and a good look at eagle coming up Really not much to this. The only issue would be a lack of concentration or focus. Um, oh, it was cruel. It looked like it was certainly going in. Uh -huh. Now this for birdie came away with par in the previous round. So for that. To 59 under, can Another I get the 60? Birdie. What a day it's been. Uh, try and get an all in one, but Sammy. Come on. Come on, be good. Be good! 
Oh. I tried right there. just a right slightly over here, that. About 20 feet away. It's no snack, though. Come on. Ooh. Just a fraction too aggressive. Remember, line and speed go together. Sometimes you want that birdie so badly, and all of a sudden you're faced with a lot of work, more work than you had hoped for, just to make the par. Let's keep the round going. Those par putts. <laughs> I can't forget Frank, your right fairway bunker ruined. Can't forget your tee. Can't forget the 1989 your Open two. Here at Royal yeah, pulled out driver, and um, there's one mm. bunker down the right side. It a perfect tee shot. What looked like it was perfect. Somehow it managed to run all the way down there and behind the lip. And of course, the rest is history. He has just hammered this drive here at the 18th and now he is in a really good position to make a birdie here in the final hole. Frank, obviously here at 18, you do not want to be long. Yeah, err on the side of caution here. Um, you're exactly right. You'd rather be 30 feet short of this flag than uh, 30 that feet That sounds nice. That sounds nice. Out of bounds. Yeah. Just a case of the hole shooting the No, they're in. It's uh... the birdie yesterday. Can I make it to 60 on the par for the first time? Charity invitation. Come on. Oh, I missed it. Damn, Damn bitch. You just pushed it. Oh, well. still, a, still a high score, though. 59 under. Never mind. Just a couple of feet. Never mind. 59 on the par. Not bad at all. That's the idea. Just knock it in. That's why you play the game to stack up the wins. Great effort right there. Frank, now the final hole here at Royal Troon. And when you think about the legends who have made the walk toward the clubhouse and the claret jug, it really does give you a sense of where <laughs> you're at. How about Arnold Palmer? Well, try to be. Tom try Watson, to be entertaining. Tom They've all made the walk on this final hole to the claret jug. And they've all hit great tee shots, and that's no. really what you need. I need there's to go to the toilet, me a right buck. Hit the ball. So there's three down the left. There's no other way around it but avoiding them. And there's one down the right if you try and play it too safe. I'm back. Gary Miller won the F EA charity in the last on Sunday for his 33rd PGA Tour title, 17th this season. God, I'm too good. To start next week, first of four FedEx playoff at Lambert begin this week with EA charity. Nice. Pittsburgh in petition. Where are we playing at? Oh, well. Oakmont. Mm. 